chain neck to end to ration and use all fortunes. Feces and your freedom of sleeping have I captured your attention. Welcome to America, land of the free, as long as you have skin like me. Where a grown man is still called a boy and put in the auction block. And his wife, his wife is pushing and breathing, breathing and pushing. And the outcome of child that is and is. Master Green Eyes son that's raised in the main house by a white woman by the name of Vince. What if you were like me, born in the 1960s, where signs on the door still read white only, and peaceful protests sparked movements, and black folks, black folks who was arrested for disturbing their peace simply because they wanted to buy something to eat but could be forced to fight for country, yet a fight for equal rights and always still incomplete. Since many believe that we can only be good at bringing that one to others in sports. But could it be a possibility that I can run further and faster than you because bloody Sunday goes to fire those collectors? What if you took my skin and put it over your face because you lived the life that my forefathers did? What if you were my friend, Fred Carey? Born in the year 1980, Houston. And on his birth certificate under race, it reads Negro. Houston, we have a problem. <laughs> so I have a question. Would you rather be lifted up as a black man to the age of 100 or as a Caucasian to the age of 50? What if you were the parents of Trayvon Martin, Eric Garner, Simon Jablan, those that murdered them were given pardon? What if all I had way back when would come to King's in? Same way they try to convince us that all lives matter today. And again, maybe all lives do matter. Black lives are excluded. What if? What if? What if?